from the Appalachian Trail in Virginia. Wow, it is a very cold morning on the AT. Whew, I think I got out of the car and it was 21 de degrees this morning. Anyway, I'm still out and I'm still doing my section of the AT today. So I am starting out at Snickers Gap and I am heading down to Morgan Mill Road. And that is the southern section right after um, you cross the West Virginia, Virginia state line. So this section is about 6.6 .6 miles, 80 miles. Um, had to blue blaze from the parking lot. Um, and then I'll go up to see Bears Den and another overlook. So it'll definitely be over seven miles total today, but that's okay. Just happy to be out on the trail even though it's cold, enjoying the trail and enjoying the beautiful sunshine that's out that will hopefully warm me up in a little bit. so many cool signs at Bear's Den. Look at that. And that is Bear's Den. It's trail center right here. For all of this hike, I am on the roller coaster. So all 6.6 .6 miles will be up and down. So on this section, there are six rollers, meaning six ups and six downs like you would have on a roller coaster. Those Oh, I got my hiking poles in my hand. Those, you know, rollers. <laughs> if you didn't know what I meant. So, definitely um, we'll let you know how I feel about those and um, if the roller coaster is worth all the hype or lives up to the hype that you hear.
today's snack for lunch, I made a mandarin orange jello salad with marshmallows and coconut um, Cool Whip. And then I have zucchini and banana and applesauce mini muffins. So that's what I'm having for snack today. At Sam Moore Shelter, stopped for um, a break here and a snack and saw that the fire was smoldering when we got here. So it was actually kind of nice to warm up our hands uh, by the smoldering fire, but I went down to the creek and made sure that I filled up my Cenoc bladder to put out that fire um, before we left. So be sure to put out fires. But anyway, nice little shelter. The privy is up that way. Um, up the hill there's a picnic table, um, but we're on the move because it's cold and we can't sit still for too long. So going back to the trail, heading Sobo, and uh, don't have too much more until we get down to the parking lot. So for the keeping it real segment of this video, it's cold. Winter hiking, it's cold. This is probably the coldest day that I've been out um, hiking. Um, when I got on trail this morning, I believe it was 21 degrees. And with the wind blowing, um, the wind chills down in the teens for sure. And um, you get wind burn from the wind on your face. Uh, my lips have been so dry, so I've had to constantly keep uh, chapstick on them. And when I first got on trail, my fingertips were burning. They were so numb. I didn't video for the first probably half a mile until I could actually get on trail and warm up. And once you get moving, it's not that bad until you hit like a ridge and you hit the wind and the wind's in your face. But yeah, always tell you guys that I'm going to keep it real for you. So that's the struggles on the trail today. But like I said, it's not too bad. And of course my nose, my nose always runs on trail. That's just part of it. <laughs> so I almost fall and bust my butt. Anyway, I'm in a rocky section. So let me put this phone down. This is also real. Breathing this hard. Most people don't video going uphill because they're breathing hard. But don't let people fool you. They are breathing hard on the uphills. And this is a big roller coaster climb coming out of the shelter, the Sam Moore shelter. Okay, you've heard enough of me heavy breathing.
Hey y'all, just doing some road work, uh, walking back to the car. So to let you know how the roller coaster was today, it wasn't that bad. Um, there were two ups um, that seemed like they weren't going to end. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it wasn't too bad. And you know, some of the downs were a little bit steep. Um, but yeah, I mean, it was, it was a good six and a half miles um, today on the trail. So, all right, well, thank you guys. I just wanted to say for helping me get to 1,000 YouTube subscribers. I'm a little over that now, so this is long overdue to thank you guys for all your love and support. Anyway, I will start next time, my next section on that side of the street. I was on this side of the street and came out to here. So I'll start on that section next time. And I hope you will stick around and join me for that one. All right, until next time, guys.